dear you. I am here to help you in any way I can, to enable you to get to a place where you feel strong, confident and able to move on from the appalling living conditions you are in. I know the amount of stress your surroundings place on you and recognize that there are no easy fixes or quick ways out for you. But just to let you know that I am here for you and will fight in your corner. You told me your story of your 21-year-old daughter who died of cancer, of how you drowned your sorrows in drink, of how you missed days of work and had to take voluntary redundancy or they would have had to let you go, of how you found yourself in a and b living off microwave meals and not sleeping for the bang, bang, bang on your door, of how it all got too much. You told me your story of how you thought that you were too old for the streets and needed to come in. You told me your story of the constant knocking at your door asking for drugs and money, the stained and dirty mattresses and the mice infestation. You told me your story of how you were seven years old when you started smoking. 13 when you started on cannabis, then gradually building up to the harder stuff of heroin and crack cocaine, of how you find it hard to pay the rent, how it would be nice to have more money to do things, but all the money you have left goes on drink and drugs, of how the addiction takes it all out of you. You told me your story and I listened, heard and believed. It took all my strength not to weep for you there and then. But that would have been about me and this is your story. You told me your story, but you said you were fine and looking and doing okay. I saw a broken, sad man who was tired, alone and afraid. You told me your story of how gardening and voluntary work was your escape. You told me your story of wanting to move out, get clean, get a job and a place of your own, but how you were too scared to do it on your own. I told you I would help and would tell the world your story. You said no one will listen. I said, I have, and now the world will. Yours sincerely.